Hello everyone, and welcome to Cocktails and Dollies. I don't know why I did that voice, it just seemed like fun. I want to preface this with saying that I'm not going with Cocktails and Dollies instead of Wine and Dollies to just be like, Ooh, I'm different. I don't drink wine, because I do drink wine. I just don't have any right now that I would drink. Um, the only wine I have is a cheap, like $5 bottle of Merlot I bought to make uh, dinner one night, because it called for it. And one, I don't drink reds, and two, cheap reds never taste good. Uh, well, as good as a red ever does taste to me. So, today I am drinking a Bahama Mama. It is one of the frou-frouiest of frou-frou drinks. Um, in here is two shots of Malibu, one shot of Captain Morgan's, about half a shot of grenadine, and a splash of pineapple orange banana juice. And it may not be that authentic, but it's delicious. You're technically only supposed to put one shot of each rum in it, but I like my drinks a little strong and the Malibu won't overpower the sweetness, because I also like my drinks sweet. Mm. So I decided I wanted to do this because it sounded like fun and I actually have stuff to talk about. I did my taxes a couple weeks ago and got my refund back so I can order Mitsu. And as luck would have it, Migi Doll is opening their order period for the Style 65 line uh, next week on the 21st. Sorry, there's a cat here and he keeps sniffing my drink. Stop. Uh, <laughs> So, and also, as luck will have it, honestly, it kind of um, sent me into a bit of a panic when I saw it. Uh, they're not releasing all the Style 65s at once, they're doing it rounds. This is normal for Miggy Doll, if you're familiar with them at all, and how they handle releases. But the sculpt I am using for Mitsu is one of the ones coming up on the 21st. And when they announced that, I hadn't uh, done my taxes yet, because I didn't have all the stuff I needed for it. And I certainly did not have like $800 for a doll. But uh, everything came in, I got him done, and the IRS was unusually fast this year, so I can order him and I am stoked. As a refresher, he will be in Mickey Doll Siho in their suntan skin. So he's going to be gorgeous. There was actually someone I saw on Instagram has a sculpt in the suntan skin, and that's what really made me decide that this particular one would be Mitsu, and so I am so happy. I still don't have a wig plan. Um, I know what eyes I want to get for him, so I'll order them a little further down the line, because I think Miggy said that their production time is a bit long now. Uh, yeah, I don't know what wig. I still am iffy on the clothes for the most part. So I guess I'll just uh, cross that bridge when I get to it. Um, and do note, there is a shirt on Tata's that is a long-sleeved black sweatshirt with metallic red lips on it. And I saw that and I said, Mitsu needs it. He needs it, he needs it, he needs it. And I'm hoping that'll be like the only black piece of clothing for him. All my dolls dress in black and I want some more color in their wardrobe. It's probably because I gravitate towards black clothes, obviously, I, I don't know. Mitsu is more like natural, muted earth tones, jewel tones, stuff like that, so hopefully I can find some pretty stuff. Um, I'm really, I'm really excited. I'll have to start looking in earnest. And Vincent with me here today because he's going to be the next victim of my uh, attempts at face upping. Uh, he still has the... Default, yep. He still has the default face up from Dream of Doll. So I might cry a little bit since they're not around. I know I say this like every video, but I'm gonna do it. We're entering into like the springtime weather here in Texas, even though it's technically not spring yet, where we get like a lot of rain and higher humidity, so it might be difficult to work around it, but I'm gonna make it happen. Also, chronically spaced. <sighs> Every video, shout out to ya. Uh, ordered some schminky pastels, which I'm really excited to play with. So I'll probably wait until those come in so we can have like a craft day where they work on Logan and I'll work on this dude. 
They're super pigmented, super soft. Everything for them is done by hand, so they're also super expensive. I did not see the grand total after they got done adding those colors to their cart, and I'm not sure I want to, but I will gladly reap the benefits of their tax return. <laughs> <laughs> also, um, I'm not in my room because I waited too late to uh, film this today and the sun went down and my room gets really dark, it doesn't get a lot of light, so I've kind of used a craft light that's on the table <laughs> to give me some better lighting than just the dining room light. And it's not great, but, 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 never fear. Uh, Chronically Spaced also ordered a ring light. It came in the mail today. They are out of town, so I am not using it yet. They should get to use it first since they bought it. So hopefully in the future I can talk them into letting me borrow the ring light for video purposes because this lighting situation I've had going on is kind of a travesty. Ooh, not good. But yeah, that's that's what's going on. I'm really excited. Uh, Mitsu will be the first doll I've purchased in well, at least over a year, I think. I'm not sure when I got Adam and he's the last one I bought. I might have purchased him last year with part of my tax return or the year before. Because a lot of stuff happened in 2017 that just made, you know, buying a doll impossible. We were saving to get a house and then things happened that kind of blew that up. So I don't remember. So, and Mitsu will also be probably the only doll I get this year, which is sad, but I'm trying to get my finances under control and doll buying is not. What else is going on? Oh, you can kind of see the shelf behind me. This is where all of our boys live. Uh, I can kind of see Nate. Nope, that's, that's Take. Take's naked because he's getting a new wig. Everyone else is crowned up there. Lewis is on the very top, lounging. It's my favorite, but he just gets to stay up there. I probably should take him down and dust him though. Whew. He's been up there and it's been like three months since we moved on and he's been there ever since I built the bookcase. That's not good. So yeah, uh, this is really short. I feel like normally these are longer and more rambly, but that's all the news I have. I'll probably squeal about getting Mitsu real soon. And uh, I look forward to doing these. I like how informal they are, even if I feel like I have a lot of lapses in thought, because I do. But uh, yeah, so I will see you guys next time, and I hope this was at least somewhat enjoyable. <laughs> Bye.